Hello everybody and welcome back. I just wanted to do the final review of our intro stem product line. Um, finally finished the majority of the products. Um, if you remember going back to April 1st when I started the products, I had three products I had to get through. I had to get through um, the cleanser, the moisturizer, the day, and then the night cream. So I made it through the full jar of um, the, the, the cleanser, the full container of it, and then also the moisturizer, the day cream, and then I still have some of the night cream, which I knew that one would, would take me longer, but I figure it's time to review it and let everybody know just what I thought of it, how I'm feeling with it, and um, if it's something that I would spend the thousand plus dollars on the full um, on those three products and then if I would invest in the full system. So I wanted to give my final review. Now, if we recall, this is for um, their, um, I think this is their basic line. There's other lines as well. And um, my, my impressions were, I think if I were to do it again, um, I would want to try a different line that they have, um, something that's more be more for dry skin um, that maybe is for geared towards aging skin. Um, being that I'm in my late 40s, I would maybe something that's more geared to fine lines, dry skin, and something more towards my skin type. But like I said, in my original video, I had entered on, um, I think it was on their website or on their Instagram. I entered one of their contests. They do monthly where you can um, give their information, give your information and you have a chance to win one of their contests where you can actually get their, whatever they're, they're giving away that month. And I won. So I graciously said, yes, I'll take it. And um, here I got three products worth valued about $900 and I decided to try them out for you guys. So these are the boxes for them and um, I have the product. So again, let's go through what the products were. And this was the um, Stem Cell Mousse Cleanser. I, I actually really liked this product. It's empty, it's done. I completely squeezed every ounce of it out. I really enjoyed this cleanser. I would do this cleanser again. Um, it was probably one of my, the favorite of this um, system. It smelled great, it was refreshing, um, light. Uh, I didn't feel dry after using it. So I really enjoyed this cleanser. Um, and I would definitely do this one again. Um, so this was a win in my book. I really liked this product. Um, the next product that you can see was the day moisturizer got through this jar as well there's a little tiny bit left in it um maybe another day's worth is in there at the bottom but um loved this as well this was light um didn't feel greasy didn't feel too heavy on the face i decided not to wear makeup on um while i'm doing this you can kind of see my skin um, I've been out of the cleanser for a while, um, so that I've been done with and I've been using a different cleanser for a while, but I've been trying to get through this and I figured, you know what, I need to just get this up there and um, since I'm almost done with this, thought this was a great day. Um, so do like this product as well. Um, it's, it's not overly moisturizing. I, I still feel like, for example, I had a facial while um, I was in um, Vegas and they said, my skin's still really dry. It's always dry though. So I, I, I would have loved, and if I was able to compliment with some of their other um, products, they have a vitamin C, they have some other target things, maybe that would have been the things I needed to address my dryness. Um, so I had to use other complimentary things from other skincares, which I'll share with you, but I'm just super dry. And so I add a bunch of things to bring moisture back. I also am working consciously on adding water. Um, 
I am not good with drinking my water. I know I'm a dietitian and um, I'm trying to drink my eight plus glasses of water a day. I am a Diet Coke kind of gal and um, I need to swap that out. Um, so that's a conscious change I'm making. I drink my coffee in the morning and um, Diet Coke and I am drinking tons of water now. Um, keeping it by me, drinking it. Um, I just need to, um, to drink more water, especially in the summer. And that's something I just, I get dehydrated really fast. Um, I don't know if it's just in my system, so I just need to drink more than the eight glasses. And so I can feel it in everything, whether it's a medication I'm taking or whatnot. I just need to drink tons of water. So I think that's part of it as well. So um, I know that um, it's that's probably part of the constant hydration issues. And I feel it in my skin. So, um, I'm working on that as well from the inside to the outside. So um, I did like the soap, not overly greasy, great for everyday wear. I didn't break out from it um, or anything. So I was happy with that. The night cream, I'm not a night cream person. Um, so I, I did um, love, um, I did like that as well. Um, I, um, I, I have I have a lot of the night cream left. I it works. Um, I got through a lot of it, um, but you use very little night cream, and so there is still a lot. I used it every day, like I said I would. Um, but I felt like it was heavy still, and I don't love heavy things on my face, so I used it, but I didn't overly use it. And um, there's still a lot in there, and so you do get a lot of it. And maybe I wasn't using enough of it, but I felt like it was enough on my face. Um, but, uh, I will continue to use this cause I know I need the moisture at night. Um, I did feel this was a little greasy, but I think all night creams are, um, I, this didn't bother me. So will I buy this again? I don't know. I may, when I'm out of everything in my house, which I don't know when that's going to be. I have a lot of stuff, but, um, if, I, I'm going to keep entering on their website and see if I can get some of their other products to try. Like I said, they have so many cool things. They have like the shot thing you give yourself. It's not literally a shot. It's not an injection, but it looks like a an injection kind of thing, a syringe that you go spot treatment wise. They have so many cool products and different systems I would love to try. So, um, and there are so many ones out there. Their vitamin C serum looks great. They have so many cool different um individual products that I do want to try and I think will enhance this and other product lines of theirs that um, are focused on different um, different targeted areas that I do want to try. Um, but right now I have so many products that I don't know if I'm going to invest in it. Um, but if I win, I'll keep entering, then I definitely will try and I'll review it for you guys and let you know if any of them are worth investing. This product line, these three products, their basic one, the intro stem, stem cell um, product line in this brown amber color. I, I like the smell of them. I like the way they worked. I, do I think they're good? Yeah, I think they're good. Do I think they were magical like I thought they would be? No. Um, I didn't, but I didn't think they did anything negatively to my skin. Um, but I didn't think, I didn't see any magic. Did I expect, um, that I was going to be magically 30 years younger? No, but I was hoping I would be, but I didn't think it was going to take off 30 years of my life. Um, I, I haven't found a product like that. If there was one, I think we would all be jumping to it, but, um, I, I enjoyed it. I didn't mind using it. I'm, I'm red because I was sitting in the sun earlier. It has nothing to do with the products I'm using. Um, I didn't cover it up. I'm not wearing any makeup right now. So this is purely um, the sun that I'm uh, having on. And um, and I had some sunscreen on, but um, I, I, I do get some coloring. So um, normally I do wear foundation to cover up the sun that I get. Um, so that has nothing to do with the products or, or rea a reaction to it. Um, I did love it. So let me share with you the products that I did use as well with it. And, um, these are the ones that I emptied. Um, I use gazillions of products, but I do, um, these are the ones that actually emptied during the time I was doing it. So it's one of these is this road, road, road deal. I think it is how you pronounce it. It's called their pink diamond instant lifting serum really like this product. Um, this felt fantastic. So this was a serum I used. This one, 
I was using prior to it. I ended up emptying it during that time period, but um, I'm not gonna be rebuying this. I actually had it from before and um, I liked it, but this was something I was using while using this product as a serum. So like before I put the moisturizer on, this was one of the serums I used. Um, one of my favorite products I use, and I go through tons of these, is this um, Babor or Dr. Babor. I don't know how you pronounce their name. I love these ampules. Um, I have tons of them, and I use one like almost daily. And they have all different ones you go through. And so I love these. And I have, I get their egg when it comes out, or their, um, they have, um, all different kits and different things. So you put these on either at night or in the morning and it's like a little ampule you break and you put the serum on. So there's different reasons. So I use the um, Pollution Protect one, I guess, during this time period. Um, and then this one was an, an exclusive skin store discovery kit that had about seven different types in there. Um, so that's an example of ones that I went through. Um, each morning before I start work or during the week, I sometimes will put these Wander Beauty eye masks on. Love them. Um, I feel like they just like kind of tighten things and make my eyes look better underneath. And I, I love them. I do face masks and put these. So I do love these Wander Beauty um, baggage, no baggage, um, baggage claim eye masks. So I have a bunch of these that I've gone through. There's like, I guess I just put through two in here in my little um, box here. I do use, um, this, um, I think it's pronounced Duix. Um, they actually they actually have the eye mask that you reuse. Um, it's spelled D I E U X um, eye cream. It's new this year. It's the um, Oracle eye eye mask eye cream. Love it. It's a great eye cream. So that I use. This is um, a hydrating complex by um, Skin Medica. So I use this, I put it either in my foundation and I mix it in or in my um, moisturizer for extra hydration. It's just a clear kind of thing that I added in for extra hydration. I used a couple different brands of that. Um, there was one I really loved um, by, oh, I can't even think of the, the brand that I used to use. Um, Dermalo Dermalogica, I think it was, and they had a great one. Um, and uh, I don't know if they even have it anymore, but I used to love that one. Um, but I always used extra hydration because I've always had this dryness and I just have patches of it. Um, and then also advanced by um, Skin Better Science. And this is for um, defense and repair serum. And I had gotten this one time when I got some skin, um, oh, what did I have done? I had, um, a treatment done and I had gotten this and I really like this for um, just when I get some redness and stuff. So I had finished this cream and this has some actually, um, oh, it, it's, um, I don't really, is it saffron? It's something in it that makes a kind of yellowish color and it's, it's actually a great product in there, but, um, it's, it, it's, it's a nice cream. It's super expensive. I won't get it again. I have so many other things to get through, but um, I use that up. So those are some of the things that I put on my face while I was using these products, but specifically these I went through, tried them, and um, liked them. Yes. Will I invest in the product line? Not until I'm all out of my stash, have tons of stuff to try, um, and just keep trying new brands until I find, find what I things I really love. There's not many things I completely want to buy again and again and again. There are certain things that I do. Um, this one, I will, if I win, like I said, I will try again. Um, and I'm hoping. I, I keep entering, so we'll see. Hopefully I do, but I was pleasantly surprised by it. Um, not overwhelming. Then I'm like, yes, I want it, but um, it's a good product. I I wasn't disappointed. I didn't stop using it. Um, sometimes you're like, nope, not doing it. I did like it. So stay tuned. Hopefully I'll win again. We'll see. Have a great day. Um, I'm going to put some makeup on. I um, just got my budget box from P. Louise. So I'm going to put on something in there and um, I'll see you later. Have a great one. Bye.